Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to talk about Oblivion races and what Nords are good for. What you should use Nords for. Now, all Nords really are is a little bit more balanced version of Orcs. Combat-wise, they're still pretty freaking good at combat, but I believe that they're just a tiny bit more magically adept. And they have a resistance to, I believe, Frost. I could be wrong on that. I'm pretty sure it's Frost because they're Nords. So, Nords, they're an interesting class in Oblivion. When you think of a combat meta, you don't usually think of a Nord. You usually go with an Orc or a Redguard. Nords are kind of an in-between between an Orc and not so much a High Elf or a Breton, but like a Dark Elf. Okay, kind of a little bit mixer-upper. And Nords, they're really good if you want to make a fighter that is kind of on good terms with everyone. You know, you're not a super unique race. Um, you're kind of more friendlier with humanoids and somewhat with elves. But Nords are really good for combat. They're really good for the mix-up combat. You know, if you, if you want to level up your strength and endurance really fast with both Blunt and Blade... It's, dude, Nords are really good at that because their blunt skill isn't really bad and neither is their blade skill, so you can kind of mix and match them when it comes to that, as well as their block is really good. Archery, not so much. But what I like to use Nords for, personally, is if I just want to play the game and make the best sword fighter that I can ever make, I usually pick a Nord. Because the Nord, I will actually use my blunt skill, level up my strength that way first, I believe it's strength. It might be endurance. No, it's strength. And then I will level up my sword skill. And then just constantly make it better, 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 better. That's the way that I like to use Nords. I don't use Nords in the first place, though, just because they're not my race. Right? They're really not. But I also like to use them kind of as... If I want to do a battle mage and I want to do more so combat, maybe like... 80% sword combat, 20% battle mage, that's what I use the Nords for. Because their magic, you can get their magic pretty freaking high. And so if you just use them as like mid-battle mid healing or mid-battle buffs or mid-battle, you know, maybe a feather spell because Nords can hold a lot of crap in the beginning. So you use a mid, middle of the game, you just boom, feather it, and then boom, heal. That's what I like to use Nords for is that kind of com combat magic mix but mostly combat. And it's a really good character if you want to start using a battle mage because they're good to learn how to mix and match the battle mage stuff with. So with that, that's all I really have to say about the Nord. It's a great class. I mean, all the races in Oblivion are really, really good. Nords are great for if you want to do, like a, like I said, 80% sword, 20% magic, maybe throw in a little bit of sneak, maybe. But with that... That's it for this video, guys. If you enjoyed, you can tell me in the comments below. Subscribe if you're new for more videos. I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer. I suck just as bad as you do at video games. And I will see you next episode, streamer, vlog of whatever I decide to make.